<clears throat> excuse me. All right, hi, Sag. <laughs> welcome, welcome back to the channel. I'm Amira. Yes, that's her. That's she, okay? Um, this is going to be a general message for the sign of Sag. If you have Sag somewhere around your chart, in your chart, around your... Listen, it's, it's spiritual messages, okay? Um, you have this think card coming out, Sag. I haven't read it yet. I know it says think on this side, and I pulled it when I was meditating on your energy, but we're going to get into what it says together after we talk about your intuitive messages here, okay? So, Sag, let's talk about the past since we're so heavily there, okay? I feel like you're heavily meditating on the past or, like, it's hard to move forward from something, job. Um... I remember speaking about it in your last reading. It felt like you were in Six of Swords energy of um, I'm trying to have peace, but the past isn't sitting well with me and the future's not sitting well with me either. So like, what are we doing? <laughs> okay, it seems like you're still here with this think card, maybe. Um, I'm also getting a lot of, I was getting a lot of music for you. Okay, Christmas music in particular, the song Slay Ride in particular, okay? I feel like it's calling for you to be present with somebody during the holiday season, or maybe this is something that you're looking forward to, Christmas, if you celebrate Christmas or whatever holiday um, around this time with friends, family, or somebody in particular, but I feel like you're being called to go with the, yeah sleigh ride literally okay you, maybe you feel like you're on a sleigh ride okay it's a slippery slope you may wind up in a ditch you may wind up on flat surface but at least you're with somebody I feel like this is kind of the situation that you're in right now like something is a roller coaster but you do have support in this is what I get all right Sag, you pulled um second house in north node okay you may have north node in Taurus or you have a significant Taurus placement or person in your energy but there's a situation here where you're like, can we get to the point already? <laughs> you're like, this Six of Swords is cool, but like, where's the Ten of Pentacles? <laughs> That's what it feels. Okay, you're like, I'm ready to be stable, okay? This whole past, pre yeah, okay, something about past, present, future tense, okay? The energy is really intense right now. I feel like you don't know... If something is in the past, if something is right now, if something is in the future, like you don't know how to refer to something or somebody, like something is really unclear, okay? I hope I can get you some clarity as we dive in. I also got something about fruit flies for you. Now, fruit flies are typically seen as annoying, right? Maybe you're feeling annoyed by the situation or somebody in your environment. <laughs> Okay, and you just want to smack them into next Tuesday, okay? I don't know why next Tuesday, but maybe maybe you do. Um, but fruit flies survive in the most difficult environments. Yeah, so are you dealing with a Pisces here? Okay, but I also was getting like, you know, lotus, lotus flower vibes, you know? They survive in the most difficult environments too. So, like, you have... You have a positive ending here, but something is like the the ride is annoying as 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 you know H E double hockey six okay. Ooh, child. All right. <clears throat> so sassy. You have this think card coming out. Let's read it. Okay. It says expect great things. <laughs> Sad. Expect great things. Okay. All right. Our minds are good at telling us what could go wrong. Yes, like getting a bad grade or our friends not liking us, but whatever you're worrying about probably won't happen and things might go a lot better than you think. Yeah, so instead of fearing the worst, try asking yourself, what if, what if, what if, what if things turn out great? That's what the card says, not me. The card says it. <laughs> okay, what if things turn out great? So you may be really anxious about something here. Okay, I feel like you're worried about an outcome instead of enjoying the ride. The ride's bumpy, but it's telling is what I want to say. Yeah, I feel like it's telling. You get a lot of clarity from the ride. Exactly. You have this think card coming out. You're thinking a lot. You're in your head a lot, okay? <clears throat> Concerned and confused is what I'm hearing, yeah. 
Okay, Scorpio vibe. We're moving into your season. You're 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 gonna you're gonna feel better soon. Okay, you're gonna feel freer soon. Um, yeah, I feel like you just kind of had to go through the motions of something. Is what I'm wanting to say. Okay, something just it had to play out the way that it is playing out. Okay, well, you know, I don't know. All right, let's see. <clears throat> All right, I'm hearing, I get the impression, okay, get the impression, what? That you don't like me, okay, so <laughs> you feel like somebody doesn't like you? Okay, peaceful self-regulation, yeah, interesting. All right, Sag, please, that's too many. These two, oh, okay. Oisty, divine mother in balance, 37 and 40. Okay, I'm getting like ages. Yeah, see, 38. So you may be um, between the ages of 35 and 40. Okay, <clears throat> um, that demographic. Um, yeah, 35 and 40. Okay. Hmm. All right, but divine mother, nurturing, compassion, and grace. I'll show you. <laughs> there it is. Okay, I just heard I have to check something. All right, I feel like somebody will be back or you have, you you need to go check something and then you'll be back. That's fine, I'll see you when you get back. All right, um, balance number 40, stability and standing firm. <clears throat> one, one second. A lot of feminine energy here. Okay, the Six of Cups. Yeah, I feel like you need to check on somebody or you're checking on somebody here, Sag. Or somebody's checking on you. Somebody you have a history with. <clears throat> I feel like you have a positive history with this person. Maybe you just haven't heard from them in a while or something. Yeah, the Hangman is here. Two of Pentacles. Somebody's been busy. Five of Wands. Three of Pentacles. Okay. Um, <clears throat> one more. I'm getting something too about a podcast, Nine of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. All right, you may be starting a podcast or seeing, um, um, seeing someone on one or hearing someone on one and you reconnect with somebody here. I don't know what this is about. Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles is here. Okay. Or this could be you starting one. All right, let's move on. I felt the need to pull on that um, really quickly, though. All right, but anyway, <laughs> back to the reading. Expect great things, okay? Expect great things, guys. You have sensuality, feminine wisdom, and passion. Okay, so feminine energy here coming in. Okay, yeah. This is why you're desiring clarity. Yeah, exactly. This is why you're desiring stability or this is someone heavily connected to you but it's coming through as you okay yeah the two of cups i mean both right i'm connected to this person but um femininity requires um or needs should i say stability needs security okay the opposite of that is anxious energy the opposite of that is confusion the opposite of that is insecurity okay so this may be someone who is needing reassurance for the future or some sense of um <clears throat> i feel like some sense of unity for the time being because again the message isn't that it's gonna be great at the end it's just like you you have you have support while you go there Okay, so let's talk more about that support. Yeah, see, two of cups, seven of cups is here. Somebody doesn't have clarity in where this relationship is going. Okay, yeah, see, there's a lover's card. Okay, let's see, where's Sash coming in with all this? Mm -hmm. Where are you coming in with all it is? Be present, spirit is saying. I'm hearing somebody is a jerk. Yeah, wow, the strength, the strength card. Okay, that was... All right, you feel like somebody's a jerk? All right, where's Sag coming in in this vibe? Yeah. <clears throat> All 
Hmm. Okay. okay, the two of swords. I feel like, Sad, you would rather agree to disagree, okay? Whatever we're talking about, <laughs> yeah, the Knight of Swords, because I feel like, okay, I'm hearing my opinion doesn't matter. All right, what is that about? Yeah, the Five of Wands. So you're arguing with somebody about this or what? Yeah, see, here's the stability right here and the moon. There's there's a lack of clarity about it. Something is unclear. There's a lot of fears and insecurities um, feeding into it. -ish. Why? Why do I have ones? <clears throat> is it because of your opinion or you're feeling this way? You feel like your opinion... <sighs> Slow down, Amira. Hmm. <laughs> it's like you don't understand me so I just won't speak I don't know that's what I'm kind of getting from you that's the vibe I get okay show me this other person since we're oh Ace of Pentacles is here show me this other person inside just reading please Who's, who, how are they coming in what's, what's up yeah balance okay stability standing firm somebody's looking for a balance Right now, something is not balanced. Even you're saying that coming in with this two of swords, you know that decisions need to be made. Things need to be sorted out, okay? But for some reason, <clears throat> you feel like they can't be or when you... Okay, we'll get into it. Show me this other person, please. Who's this other person? What's up? What's, what's their vibe? What do they got going on? Huh? How are they feeling? Okay, is it a Scorpio or heavy Scorpio placement I'm getting? That's you. Let's put that back. Nine of Wands was trying to come out. Just one, please, for this person. Thank you. The Magician. Yeah. This person's over here like overly concerned about stuff okay or <laughs> it's weird okay the magician hangman hmm somebody likes to have control here <clears throat> as well from what i see what's the magician though like why are they coming in like this Because of the Page of Wands, Queen of Wands, yeah. And the Three of Cups. Hmm. Let me see your Two of Swords here. in the two of swords because of the eight of pentacles and the king of swords hmm. <clears throat> yeah you have a different opinion period yeah and the world card is here so this may be a different opinion from a group of people and and that opinion may cause um I don't know why I'm hearing squandering. Okay, it's an interesting word to use. Okay. So that opinion may cause this other person, from your perspective anyway, to distance themselves. I mean, but if it's your truth, <clears throat> then that would be what's creating this anxiety within you, right? Because your truth is going to be your truth, whether you like it or not. Yeah, the Empress is here. Nine of Pentacles. Hmm. <clears throat> okay. Let's close this reading out with some messages from this person. Let's see if we can get some more clarity, huh? 
Does this person have to say the size, please? I just heard Degrassi, okay, the show. I've never watched it, I don't even know what it's about, so I'm not sure how it um, pertains to your situation or this situation at all. I think it has something to do with teenagers, all right, or that's what I'm getting anyway. All right, what's this person want to say to Sagittarius, please? What do they want to say to Sag, please? I just heard, will you marry me? Fights, arguments, and conflict. Okay, so this is what they want to say. They want to fight about marriage or proposal I gave into temptation okay why do they want to fight what are they why are they upset <laughs> like what it's interesting why why is all this why why whoa yeah look at this mask and unexpected is here okay so this person is upset because they don't expect whatever it is that you've got going on or you decide to do. It looks like you're deciding to do nothing from what I saw. Yeah, see, you are you are the person of my dreams. Somebody feels like you're the person of, of their dreams, Sag. And it feels like they're waiting for you to make a decision, but you're choosing not to make a decision. And that's kind of where we're at with that. Okay. Um, let's see this person's next moves. Why not? We're over time, but I feel like it's important. This person's next moves, please. What are they gonna be doing? I'm I'm getting a hug, okay? So they're gonna be giving you a hug or they want to embrace you, okay? They want to be physically close, I suppose. Okay. Their next moves. The tower. Okay, so they're bringing in this surprise. So they may be telling you, Sag, yeah, the Ace of Swords. This person is going to be honest with you about how they feel, about what they want, about what they're waiting for. They're going to be honest with you about wanting your truth. And it feels like you guys are going to have a clear conversation. Yeah, the Five of Swords is here and the world, okay? So this conversation is going to be really telling. Yeah, did I say that earlier? Okay, there's something in this conversation that is allowing you to have the clarity that you need. <clears throat> which is what we've been looking for and searching for throughout this entire reading. Um, and maybe somebody's taken a while to get to that point, okay? Or you feel like it's like you're dragging it. Just say the truth already, okay? Maybe you feel like this person is in the Two of Swords. Place yourself where you belong. But there is some clarity that's being achieved here and all this tough, you know, it's like pulling teeth kind of energy is coming to an end, okay? You're going to have clarity and you're, you're, you're going to be moving forward from that weird energy okay i'll see you guys next time